I think I'll أنا بختم الأجوبة لأن في بعض الأسئلة فيه ممكن تكون مكررة حق الأشياء اللي قلناها بطريقة أخرى أوكي بس عشان ما تملون ونبتدي بسرعة التحكيم لأن معظم الأشياء اللي تكلم فيها وهو يحكم بتلاحظونه الطريقة الانتقائية يمكن هو بعد يعلق على بعض الطيور اللي فيها فيذر كواليتي ولا بادي سايز مثلا ولا هذه أثناء التحكيم يسوي This last question, we will skip some of the questions here, and we'll go to the last question. What's your advice to the newcomers to the Jack Green type of the best advice you can give? The best advice I can give to a new breeder is do not give up. It, the Jacobins, as a new breeder, you, you can understand that the ones that have been in it for a while, this is a crazy breed. It's a mean breed. It, it, it'll scalp its own young. It's, uh, it, it discourages you uh, sometimes because sometimes they don't fertile well. They don't feed well. I have built, or built a, uh, a stud of Jacobins that I, when I breed 35 pair together, I raised 150 babies with no feeders. And I let the birds feed their own. So you have, to, you have to decide on how you're going to do it, but you don't get it discouraged because this particular breed is not, it's not a really a good breed to start with as a beginner. There's so many tri trials and tribulations that you don't really see coming. And, and those can be discouraging. For, for, for the guys that are here, it looks like you're all pretty much into it. But for young boys or something, this is to give them rollers or homers first to let them get used to it and then to the Jacobins. But as you guys uh, venture into the breed and you see things that are discouraging, just stick with it. They'll, they'll, you, will sign, you will soon find that everything will iron itself out. You will learn by any of the mistakes you made and you'll make mistakes and that's why you, you'll learn. And, and uh, so the best advice I can give you is don't ever give up. Put more intensity to it if you see the problems and understand why the problem has occurred and then you have control of it at that point. Once you know why you're not uh, happy with what you're doing, then you've got it beat already. So just stick with it and you'll do well. يتعلق بالنصيحة حق المربين الجدد المبتدئين طبعا تقول ما شاء الله عليكم وبين عليكم كلكم مربين وعندكم خبرة وهذه بس هو ينصح المربين الجدد اللي توهم بادين يقول طيب طبعا طير الجاكوبين طبعا النصيحة هي انه لا تستسلم وواصل في الشغل اللي قاعد تسويه لان طير الجاكوبين طير يعني هو قالها مين انا اقول طير نحيس طير ما يربي عياله ولا يحضن ولا يسوي شيء اللي انت تبغيه دائما تبغي تعده ما يبي طير جاكوبين يبي له صراحه ان انت تربي لفتره عشان تتعلم عليه اكثر بسهوله الناس اللي يدشون الجاكوبين يتركونه على طول لانه هو اختار من البدايه نوعيه صعبه وفعلا البفوطه يبي له صبر وطوله بال فهم الستاندرد وفهم انه انواع الريش وشو الاشياء المطلوبه وطرق الاعداد فطير صعب صراحه مو مثل الطيور الثانيه البيسك مثل القلاليب والزواجن والهادي لكنه يبي له صبر اوكي فاذا واحد تو داش في الهوايه يستحسن يدش مثلا في شيء ابسط من كذي بس اذا بيدش في البفوطه لازم يكون عنده اصرار وتركيز ورغبه انه هو يحقق الشيء اللي تفضل